What is good, y'all? Welcome back to another video. It's your boy Eddie, aka Insane. We is at the body shop right now. I just actually got here because if you guys saw the last video, I told you guys we was gonna install the exhaust today, where we're gonna get sound clips, and that's what we're here to do. He told me to pull up at nine because that's what we're gonna do, and I'm here. It's like 9:08. And uh, yeah, we're about to get this shit installed. Shouldn't be too hard to put this exhaust. We know we have to cut a piece of the carbon diffuser a little bit off just so it could fit right. We'll see right now. It's a beautiful day out today, man. It's a beautiful day outside today. Got the brown shades on today. Feeling nice, feeling spiffy, you feel me? Dude, it's crazy how the filter looks like when I have these on compared to when there's n when I don't have them on. <laughs> I like this. It gives it a nice, nice vibe. <laughs> We're installing it right now. Came just in perfect timing, and they're about to cut a little piece off the fit right down a little bit. But we're trying to get it fitted, and then don't worry, we're gonna get it cleaned up so it's all nice and spiffy, bro. Cause we got no gloves on. There's fingerprints, and I don't want that shit to burn on there. But yeah, that's what they're about to do. I'm about to chop it off a little bit. Peace. There Y'all yeah. seeing it now, but it's about to look sick. We're getting the mid side installed right there. We got that hanger in, so that hanger's pretty much in. We got the hanger set up over here. Still not screwed in yet though. And then they still got tying up the bolts over here, but it's pretty much. Coming along, looking good. Guys, she's officially on. We just got her wiped down nice and clean so you can see the RK Titanium right here. And on the tip, bro, it looks so damn good. Got the whole damn thing cleaned up right now. Looks so good, bro. Hella good. Super excited to see how this thing sounds when it's on. Oh, look, you see the RK Titanium right under. You see the logos making sure we show them. <laughs> it looks hella good, bro. You guys can see. We'll probably move this around a little bit later, but it is not hitting. Oh, it probably is. I don't know. Oh, there you go. It looks like it's hitting a little bit, but we'll fix that a little later. Hopefully, it don't burn the diffuser off. <laughs> yeah. See, we'll probably have to go and buy a guard or something just in case it don't hit. But damn, bro, she's looking hella good, bro. With the arcade just peeking like that, poking, bro. Bro, it looks hella good. Everything looks clean. You feel me? Got it all cleaned up with a brake cleaner and everything like that. So, looks hella good. Hmm, wonder where this is supposed to hang to. What the? Hold up, this is supposed to hang on to something if it's here. So right now, I'm gonna see if we can get some sound clips. I don't know, that I heard him saying that he was gonna push it, but hopefully I get Luis to come and turn it on real quick just so we can hear how it sounds. Cause I wanna hear how it sounds, bro. Just so we can get the first cold start and just hear it. Cause I definitely wanna hear how it sounds, bro. Make sure there's no, you know, like leaks or anything like that either, just to make sure, you know? So hopefully, we can do that because I want to hear it and I want to make sure there's no leaks because then once it's on the floor and all that bro but I was looking at the placement right now I probably just when I take this car to House of Power or something like that I'll have them look at it and see if it needs to be moved around or anything like that because you know just to make sure double check she look good she looks hella good nice but like I said I want to get sound clips so we can both hear it all of us and just to make sure there's no any exhaust leaks but i know there's no battery in there so they're gonna have to probably jump it hopefully they do that for me we might have to adjust the way it sticks out probably want to take it to house of power or something like that but it's cool it'll do for right now like as long as it's not hitting you feel me well this will do for now we'll get it more aligned a little later but it's not even hitting it's just like oh at the top <laughs> crazy but Damn, bro. This poke looks hella good. Hella good, hella nice. I like that poke. And by the way, did y'all know my dad's truck that got hit? Bro, it comes back this Friday. <laughs> it's already done painted, bro. I'll just show you guys, it's over there. But it's already done painted and it comes back on Friday before my car, which is crazy. Almost done though, almost done. Hopefully damn soon. 
And unfortunately, guys, we couldn't get a first start. <laughs> Why? Because the battery is dead and I actually have to buy one. <sighs> unfortunately, we couldn't get it started, but at least we got to see it get installed. It's all nice and shiny. And he told me that the car's not even getting started anytime soon. So that's the good thing. So I won't miss the startup, first startup or anything like that. I'll be straight, I hope. But I did tell him if he does start it, let me know, bro. So I can get a video or get a video for me, whichever one. But hopefully we get some news pretty soon. He gives me a call and tells me that they're going to start it or something like that. But he did tell me they are still missing the front sensor. He's been, he showed me text messages where like, he's trying to get that front sensor, but people are just saying like, they don't have it or it's taking too long whatever it is but hopefully we get that shit damn soon we're just gonna wait now he's gonna do the paint calipers he's got to paint the calipers still then the seats got to get installed and he can't really install the front lip until he gets the sensor because it's in the front bumper so he can't really do anything about that but yeah don't look so by the base of him telling me that the front sensor hasn't even came or anything like that bro I am not getting my car on Friday. Just just by him telling me that shit, that shit already made me lose hope <laughs> for getting that car by Friday. Damn, bro. Like, it, it is what it is type shit. It'd be one of those things. It is what it is, and I can't do nothing about it. It's out of my control. But it's annoying. It annoys the fuck out of me, bro. <laughs> ah! All right, so... I got home. I went home and changed and all that good go. And uh, right now I'm headed to the gym, but I actually just left uh, a shop because if you guys see my old videos with the Camry, I used to take the, my Camry to a shop uh, for coilovers, at, like literally right by my house. It's called Fantasy Motorsports. Yeah, I went there because I know they can get me tires. So I stopped by and asked them if they were able to, you know, get me some r triple eights for the Supra and, uh, you know, and he said he could, he could get them for me, but I'm gonna go back later because he was busy right now. So I'm gonna go back later. I'm gonna go hit the gym, get my workout in. Then I'll go back. Yeah, place the order for tires because like I told you guys, I need tires and I'll have them balance it. And they also do ceramic coating. So I will have them do ceramic coating on the wheels as well. So yeah, that's where the wheels are gonna go to. We're gonna take it to the Fantasy Auto, Fantasy Motorsports and uh, have them take care of the wheels, get them all mounted, balanced and all that good stuff. Gonna get this workout in. So if y'all haven't got that workout in, make sure y'all go get your workout in, bro. There you go. Right. Okay, just got done with the gym, bro. <laughs> this dummy tired. But now I gotta go put diesel in this because they got no diesel. And then I gotta go home. And then I gotta go place the order for the wheels. I mean the tires. Cause I need tires. Sometimes, bro, I don't even know what to vlog. <laughs> Sometimes I feel like I should just let the camera roll. But then sometimes I'm like, bro, they ain't nothing going on. Like, they really ain't nothing going on. Like, all my boys is working. I don't have my car to go out and do vids on it. Like, just bear with me, guys. Bear with me. I'm trying to make... We're going to make more content, but... <laughs> we just got to get the super back. Oh! You guys almost fell back. So right now... I'm walking to Fantasy Auto, to Fantasy Motorsports, like I told you guys earlier, to get the tires. Cause I told you it's not that far from my house, so I was like, I'm gonna just walk it. Why not? Enjoy the weather. Take a nice little walk. I don't know what size I want to do yet, just because I'm debating if I want to do 295s in the rear. But my dad was telling me to do 305s, but I don't know if I want to go that thick. But I might. But yeah, so I got. I think I'm going with 275s in the front, and I'm. Either debating 295s or 305s in the rear. But well, I don't know. I'm gonna see right now with my boy. He'll tell me what specs to go with, what tires and all that. We'll go from there. And look, bro. Look at what I see when I'm outside, bro. A Ferrari, bro. Oh my god. I don't know my specs. I'm sorry, but it could be a 488. Could be. Could be. Could be right. I don't know. But that shit is nice as fuck. And then look at that. Rolls Royce. Crazy. Looking beautiful as fuck. But yeah, bro. We're here at Fancy Motorsports. We're headed home. And unfortunately, bro, they couldn't find the tires. They're like out of stock right now. Well, at least the rear ones. The front we we could get, but it's the rear tires that we can't get. So we're either looking for 305s or 295s. And right now, they're out of stock. And the problem is, we don't know the ETA. Like, that's the problem. We don't know the ETA, and I kind of want to have them done by this week. So he said he was going to check on Wednesday. He's going to let me know. Then he was going to check Friday. He'll let me know. So 
we'll see if we get them either this week next week we don't know that's the problem the whole eta situation so so what's up y'all it is the next day about to go into the gym again staying on the grind but like i told y'all yesterday uh fantasy motorsports was supposed to get my tires but i ended up getting them myself i ended up getting them on, getting them on summit racing because they had them there i guess the guy that he was trying to go with just didn't have them but i went with summit racing and they had them in stock so we should get, be getting them by the end of this week next week on monday but they should be arriving pretty soon i ordered them yesterday last night and i actually have to buy a battery for the super because like i said the, like i think i said it yesterday but the original battery is dead it's done so you feel me so i have to buy a new battery so i think after the gym i'm gonna go to autozone and pick up a battery bro i just looked up i looked it up right now bro they're pretty expensive bro i'm looking at like 270 for a battery i was like god dang bro that's insane they're expensive I don't want to buy another one. I was going to get a lithium one, but damn, hell not, bro. I'm looking at like seven to almost a thousand dollars for a lithium battery. And it's because it's lightweight, but yeah, you know what? I'm good over that. And this is the homies 370Z. This thing is clean, bro. This is like the cleanest 370Z I've ever seen, bro. And I've told him that genuinely. He's taking it to the track and everything. That shit is nice. All right, y'all. So we got the. Well, I'm out the gym and been out the gym. This is like the second Auto Zone I came to, bro. Because the first one didn't have it. This one had me all like, "Damn, bro, are they gonna have it or not?" And thank God they had it, bro. So we got the battery right here on the floor. I don't know if you can see that, bro. Two hundred and seventy-seven dollars for a battery. <laughs> Crazy, bro. But damn, that shit is heavy too, bro. I was like, damn. Bro, crazy shit right now. It is hailing, bro. These are like rocks. <laughs> shit, bro. I don't know if you guys can see it. But, bro, it is hailing. Holy shit. I'm trying to get it for y'all, but it's hard to see. I don't know. I'm trying to see if I can grab some. Look, it's ice. <laughs> anyway, my tires are here. Holy shit. Our triple A's. Let's see which one are these. Uh, I don't even know what size these are. Let me see. These are the 295. So these are the rears, and yeah, bro, as you can see, some pretty meaty tires. <laughs> They're gonna look so damn good though on the damn car. Holy shit. Now I just gotta wait till it stops raining, bro, so I can put them in the garage, bro. We got two of them. Now we're missing two more. They should be arriving Saturday or tomorrow. Who knows, bro? Now we got two tires. Hell yeah, bro. I could definitely not use these in the rain. For sure not. First set of R Triple H ever. We're gonna see how they how they how they hold up. Dude, there is like a lot of hell just going on right now. Look. Oh. You see that? Bro, it's raining like crazy right now. Y'all hear that? Damn, bro. Look, my whole thing is flooded, bro. It just, like, comes and goes the rain, like, hard as fuck. And then I'll stop like this, and then hard as fuck again with, like, hella lightning and thunderstorm. But, yeah, bro. They flooded our house, me. What's happening, y'all? It is the next day. I am on my way to the body shop because they are painting the calipers right now. But, yeah, they took off the wheels, and they're starting to paint the calipers. I got the call. They were telling me that they're doing that and uh yeah and i gotta take them the battery to get the battery installed and hopefully get the first cold start and the first start with the exhaust i'm definitely excited hopefully we could get that in in this video bro because i definitely want to just hear it bro and i want you guys to hear it as well i did say in the beginning that i wanted to get sound clips so let's hope we could get some sound clips today all right so i'm here at the shop and i'm looking at the wheels right now the brake calipers actually looking at the calipers and uh yeah, the blue that I went with, the color that I picked out, isn't the color that I expected it to be. <laughs> but it's okay, we'll probably get them redone. Um, but yeah, uh, it's all good. It's just not the blue that I was hoping for. It's like a dark blue, but it's, it's all good. This is how it looks. So yeah, this is the blue that it came out. It's like a dark navy blue. Um, it's okay. I do need to get white stickers for the Toyota Super to pop out. But um. Yeah, we might end up repainting them or something, a different color. 
Probably like a brighter blue or something like that. But it's all good. The more that I look at it, it's, it's not that bad actually. Because <laughs> then the white wheels is going to look good and the sticker is actually like that color. So on the work wheels. So actually not that bad. It looks actually good. It's growing on me little by little. <laughs> so damn, bro. We got the titanium peaking again. And they're just painting it. Let me send it off. But we got the rears. You can barely see it because it's dark on this side. But and they got to this side too. There you go. It looks kind of purple on this side, but it's blue. It's like a navy blue. <laughs> but then we also, when we get the stickers, the white stickers will look good. Or I want to see how they'll look with the wheels too. Because whatever it's like, a, it looks good with this blue. Or I don't know. But it looks good. Bro, I was just looking at my tires right now. I thought I, they were bald, but they're not that bald, if I'm being honest. They're not that bald. They're still pretty good. But looking at these two, I could probably use these as like burnout tires or something. Yeah. Take them to the pit. Except for this side. This side looks like the almost pretty worn out. Damn, bro. Can't get over how the exhaust looks. It looks so damn good. Just look at that. No, we still have the cover, so hopefully they put that on too. But yeah, we're about to get her started. I brought the batteries right here. We're about to put it on and we're about to get the first start up, bro. I don't even know how it's going to sound, bro. I'm so excited. It's probably going to be hella loud. Just leave a like right now because I'm hella excited. Bro. They just took the tape off and damn, it looks good. I'm not even going to lie. It looks good. Obviously, the disc is just, I mean, the rotor is hella dirty and dusty, but it looks good. Not bad, holy shit. And then if we just had the white sticker, the Toyota sticker, and then with the bl white wheels and then the blue work wheel, oh, gonna be sick. But I don't know if the work wheel is this color. We got to find out. But what y'all think, bro? What do y'all think of that color? It's pretty fire. Let me know, let me know. All right, so right now he's putting in the battery. Oh, everything that needs to get installed. All the, and there it goes. So the battery's in, it's there. Now we just gotta see if we get some life right now. If we get some life, we about to see all the lights turn on and we about to hear the exhaust for the damn very first time, bro. The first startup since we heard the last startup like, woo, like months ago, bro. So we're about to hear how it sounds with the exhaust and it's probably gonna sound so damn good. Hopefully we get some revs too. And we got life, the lights turned on. Oh, there it is. Battery is on. As you guys can see, everything just turned on. Lights. You see, it's probably not on. We're about to get some quick revs real quick. No, no. Ah, okay, okay. He knows my car more than me, bro. Alright, let's get a couple revs. Let's see how it sounds. Brake system. Oi. Oi. Damn, this probably needs to be It is on limp mode right now. I could tell. I could. I could see it. Yeah. Damn, bro, but those pumps. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Damn, bro. Well, you guys heard it, bro. Oh my God, it sounded hella good. I wish I got the last clips outside for you guys, but he was scared to step on it. Even though I was giving him permission, bro. He was scared to step on it. But it's all good. Either way, bro, it sounded hella amazing, bro. Just that cold start was crazy, bro. It was so good. But yeah, I think we're gonna end up getting this realigned somewhere. Else, maybe a house of power get that real line because it moves a, it moves a little bit it like shifts this side then moves a little to the bottom so we're gonna get this real line let's show and she's on the floor wow she's looking hella good now calipers are all painted up oh you can't really see but the, the calipers you can now see it you can now see it but it's gonna look way better with the white wheels and the whole thing is gonna be on point so he's about to move it right now let's see how it do Damn, the lights look sick. Damn, bro, she sounds so good. And just look at the lights, too. Jeez, that's sick. This is my first time seeing the lights connected. It looks so sick. The tail lights still ain't connected, though. But fuck, bro, she sounds so damn good. She sounds hella good. Yeah. Dale, dale. Ahí vas, ahí vas. Dale derecho. Se queda igual a la tropa ahí. Sí. Dale, dale. Dale, dale. Ahí está. And uh, she's a hello good. We will see when we see her again. Maybe when I bring the wheels and the tires or some shit. I don't know when we're going to see her again, honestly. Oh, probably when I bring the seats next. Yeah, that's probably when we're going to see her again. I have to bring the seats and they're probably going to start doing that all next week. And this is what we've been waiting for, bro. This damn sensor. We are still waiting on that sensor. It still hasn't arrived. It's been weeks since that sensor hasn't arrived. So that's really all we're waiting for. So he can install the lip and the side skirts. And then the door canards, like, there's still stuff to be added, bro. Like, the damn seats. A lot of stuff yet to come on the car, bro. So if you guys aren't yet subscribed, make sure you guys are subscribed, bro. Because there's a lot more stuff coming for the Supra. A lot more things to do, even when it comes back, bro. So stay tuned, bro. Stay tuned. She's almost back, y'all. She is almost back. So, as you guys just saw, bro, we got the first startup, bro. It sounded so amazing. A couple revs, bro. Oh my god, it sounded so damn good. And hopefully, he said, I'm not, you know, I'm not even gonna say nothing, bro, because I don't wanna, I don't wanna say nothing, bro, and jinx it. But yeah, we're just gonna leave it at that, bro. If y'all enjoyed this video, make sure y'all hit the like button, hit the subscribe button if you guys are not yet part of the family. I'm telling you guys, a lot more stuff is coming for the Supra even when it comes back bro. star lights charge pipe intake like all these things yet still to come for the super bro like oh, i'm just so excited can't wait but like i said bro make sure y'all hit the subscribe button don't miss out but this has been your boy eddie and I'm